Okay, so I was looking, um... I could probably trade for some tech and get another assault, which wouldn't be too bad. Considering I have all these assault rifles and shotguns. And I could just go crazy manufacturing grenades. Which may not be like the worst idea in the world either. You have 98 tech. What did I need again? 33. Oh, you guys have another guy available? You have a Sinedrian assault. Huh, I don't know what their assault armor is like. Looks like I'm gonna go find out. Fifty-one. Is that enough? Thirty-six. Four thirty-one. Yeah, we're good. I might want to build a scarab as well. At some point. All right. Let's see what we got. Oh, interesting. So it's kind of like a combo of a sniper and an assault. So only 18, 20, and 18. Accuracy, accuracy, accuracy 10, 2, and 4. Well, that's interesting. Oh, and we need more med kits as well. So we're trading for more tech. Oh man, I'm out of food. At least I have six people now. I thought I had a scavenging mission around here. Okay, Fort Liberty is in crisis. There's been an ongoing starvation for some time now, and to top it all off, the Haven's overstrained food production facilities are breaking down. It looks like something may have gotten into the water, but the Haven lacks a better filtration system. Uh, could the Phoenix Project use some of its advanced tech to help track down the exact nature of the problem? Um... Yeah, let's help. Things have been suffering with New Jericho recently. The damage to the Haven's crops is being caused by a previously unknown strain of phytoplasma. Normally, transmission requires an insect vector, but this strain seems to be transmittable via water. Very uh, hard to kill. Luckily for the people of Fort Liberty, our scientists are very good at killing bacteria. The results of the study should also prove useful for our own projects. So we got some research. Embalmed. What appears to have once been a textile factory, our operatives have discovered hundreds of mummified bodies covered in thin film of mucus. It's unclear whether the mucus was deposited on the bodies by an external source, whether it was excreted during the process of mummification. Representatives of the disciples of Anu uh, demand that the bodies of the martyrs be turned over to them for study, while New Jericho demands that the bodies be destroyed to prevent infection. Well, I don't have any tech, so... 
Uh, that wasn't too bad of a hit. And we got food. The disciples thank us for protecting the bodies of the martyrs from the heathens at New Jericho. Reward us for our good deed. Blessed are those who seek transformation. But to seek alone is not enough. Neither is to speak. For these were the ways of the false gods of old, who drowned in the flood that Anu commanded. To be initiated further into the sacred teachings of the Exalted, you must show that you will act on behalf of humanity. Not merely the humanity that was, but the humanity that will be. There are some who still cling to the sins of the old world. Even now they are consumed by greed, thinking that if they hoard enough, they will survive the coming changes. These brigands have attacked many of our havens, and those of others also. Let the judgment of the dead god fall upon them. We'll cast them out. Let the pain they have visited upon others be returned unto them tenfold. Okay, so if we do this, uh, we'll get their havens. Uh, so it looks like we're going to be Disciples and Sanhedrin aligned. What did the scan complete? Where's my scan? Oh, I don't have enough resources for it. Oh, boy. Well... Let's just work our way across. Longnius Point is a well-armed and extremely isolated haven that rarely deals with the outside world. Its leader, Justinian Sinaweird, uh, is once prominent a member of New Jericho, split with Tobias West over the latter's obsession with genetic purity, taking much of Vandium's old advanced genetics warfare division with him. The split led to an extremely bloody two-day battle in June 2043, and they've remained sworn enemies ever since. Sign of Weird is contacted, has contacted our operatives and allowed them into the Haven, but only because he needs our help. After we broke with West, he explains, we named our new organization Alchemy because we intended to have the kind of flexibility West is incapable of. This seems we are lacking the right alchemist. The alchemist in question is a geneticist now working for the Disciples of Anu. Sinoweird wants uh, this individual retrieved and is willing to pay for their services. Um... When I could improve my relationship with New Jericho a little bit. And I have been trying to be nice to the disciples. Um, yeah. New Jericho is swift to act and soon Lamia's point is burning. Ouch. New Jericho plus 10. Nice. Sinedrian didn't like that though. Fuck. I wasn't expecting that. Wanna hurt my Sinedrian peeps? We don't have any PDWs yet, so... Let's go with strength and will. You, sir. Probably... Probably speed and will. Wouldn't mind getting a little bit more strength for a little extra health because that armor is so thin. 
fortitude, will, and ten to perception. Um, considering will would be twenty points. It's uh, not a bad value. Let's give a little bit more health. His 20 is already pretty fast. Uh, the rest we should probably be putting into will and speed. Try to save the Phoenix skill points for uh, once they get maxed out, but I'm not sure they do max out anymore. Operatives have set down in what appears to be a destroyed haven. There was a fight here, and it wasn't pretty. Looks like the people in the haven turned on each other. There are bodies everywhere. No one survived, or if they did, they are long gone. Materials and food. Oh, I need tech. Our operatives have recovered some resources, but found no indication of what caused the conflict. Alright, Arthrons! I uh, might want to build some of these to get that shred going. Alright, um, early mutations of the creature type are associated with the first misincursion of 2029. The vast populations that were compelled to walk zombie-like into the sea under the influence of the mist have been merged somehow with sea creature DNA to create these Frankenstein monsters. Now we see an increased numbers of Arthrans on land. The hypothesis is that land-based gestation structures are breeding Arthrans under the cover of new mist outbreak. The latest Arthran mutations have little humanity left in them. They're considerably more dangerous to civilian populations. The longer term danger is that we can expect their evolution to continue at a rapid pace. While analyzing the Arthran exoskeleton biochemistry, uh, we covered the notes of And Alexander Danchev, a Phoenix scientist who became obsessed with bioengineering and armored suit made from Arthran-derived chitin. He constantly referred to revelations that came from his dreams, and he began to alienate his colleagues with his weird behavior. Randolph Symes eventually banned him from this line of research. Unfortunately, his madness consumed him, and he fled C Phoenix Point with valuable lab equipment. Dinchev's files contain encrypted plans for an expedition to a Pandorian, Pandoran mutation center located through his dreams. We can attempt to decipher his files and get the location. We managed to pinpoint a location and we should send a squad to investigate. It's a long shot, but given what we know about Pandoran mutations, Dinchev might have been onto something. The disciples of Kanyo Haven is under attack. Okay, they look like they might win. I have time to finish this. Okay, I have food again, so let's uh, swing down here. Okay. And this will give me resources to research complete. Alright, Sinedrian is an amalgamation of several political movements, with roots in socio ecology, anarcho uh, syndicalism, and similar belief systems. Built on a strong opposition to hierarchy, Sinedrian is an egalitarian and radically de uh, democratic, with decisions being made via public assembly. Despite this, certain more prominent individuals do exist, 
Two streams of thought have begun to crystallize. The polyphonic tendency, who believe the origin of humanity's dysfunctional relationship with the environment, lies in hierarchies of dominance, and the terraformers, who believe in putting humans first, are less opposed to the idea of leadership. The current official goal of Sinedrian is finding a way to coexist with the new ecosystem, but that goal is challenged from within. We got lots of tech. Sinedrian was built on a dream. A world without hierarchies, without leaders, where human beings could embrace the potential of technology without its destructive side effects. The radicals of the old world had been proven right. The status quo could not sustain itself. But what now? What was the next step? Some argued for coexistence with the Pandoran ecosystem, hoping for a peaceful solution. Others advocated putting humanity before nature and claiming the planet for themselves. Trusting in the safety of their havens, the people of Sanhedrin argued about the best way forward, but the Pandora virus had little interest in their arguments, and its power was still growing. Okay, low threat. Decent amount of resources. Jericho will be pissed that I saved them, but whatever. Alright, two of grenades to equip. Oh, this only takes one action point, too. Very nice. Active range 17. Oh, so I have to get pretty close. Maybe you are not the best person for it. Okay, it looks like we have enough grenades for everybody. Oh, sniper rifle's done. Maybe the uh, Earl Pistol wouldn't be the worst thing in the world for you. Yeah, I think we're good to go. Biome? Shantytown or something? The hell is going on down here? It's like training equipment, maybe? Huh. Moving now. Heading out. Hi. Well, jump back Moving down. Position. I 
hope we can kill him in one hit. Hostile. Oh, yikes. Shoddy does. Did I not pack shoddies? Oh, I think it's this guy. It is you. Well, receiving loud and clear. So I didn't need to use the war cry, but there are worse things in the world than wasting some will points. Moving to coordinates. Is this my level one guy? Yeah, it is. Damn it. Seriously? What the fuck was that? So 360 acid, is that like just gonna straight up kill him? Roads 10 armor per turn. If there's no armor, then the damage is applied to the body part. Acid value reduces by 10 per turn. Receiving loud and clear.
you get acid too? Did not. Seeing there's no valid targeted jet channel. Shot. Apparently, you shall have it. Hostile mist. What the fuck did it hit? God damn it. Let's do this. Ready to fire. Hostile down. On the move. On the double. Yep, so the armor only protects you for one turn. Well, that's a lesson learned. I probably well, could have potentially have run him out to escape. That's fucking deadly. guy to damn it well did not recover his machine gun or anything doesn't look like I got all those materials and stuff but seems kind of bittersweet because I probably lost overall to recruit another person cost more than I gained I'm curious what their assault armor looks like Thirty-three, three ninety-seven. Oh, I'm gonna be out of food again. Turning and turning, one of our operatives has reported experience repeated lucid nightmares of floating up into the sky, helplessly twisting and turning, in a nausea-induced spiral motion that seems to defy the principles of Euclid 
You city in space. They always broke up, woke up before they could uh, see where they were going, but sensed a frightening presence waiting for them there. Medical examination says nothing wrong with the operative. Streams seem to have stopped for now. Well, get my new soldier. And I'll end this video after I equip him. So, what do you got? We have 23 armor. Actually, I think I like this better than. So, more armor, but no speed increase except for the legs. But they have more armor than the Odin. So, I do think I like this better than the Sinedrian assault armor. Armor is probably more useful for assaults than than accuracy, I imagine. Although we could potentially use the assault armor on like a sniper. So they won't get as much accuracy out of it, but they'll be a little more protected. So 14, 18, and 16. This is 18, 20, 18. Yeah, so they'd have to get a little bit closer, but they'd be more protected. Alright, well, he has an assault rifle. A med pack. A grenade. Uh, probably needs ammo. Four. All right, I need to do this and start working on Sinedrian again. But I'll do that in the next video. I hope you enjoyed this one, and I will see you in the next.